Welcome. You may be seated. <laughs> Welcome to our undergraduate graduation ceremony for the Nicholas School of the Environment on this lovely day where it deigned to not rain despite threatening. <laughs> Perhaps I shouldn't have said that. My name is Charlotte Clark. I'm the Director of Undergraduate Programs here in the Nicholas School of the Environment. Of my three Duke degrees, one was as an undergraduate in 1979, and then I was a uh, Master of Environmental Management student after that. So I have sat in the seats where you have been. I also am a Duke parent, so I have sat in the seats where many of the others are, you, are now today. So I work here with a world-class team of faculty and staff and they engage in so many ways with your sons and daughters, and I wanna recognize them to you now. First, we have directors of undergraduate studies here who work with your students to assign majors, plan events, recruit and publicize our academic and co-curricular programs, advise when things are unclear, not that that ever happens, uh, ensure that study ab abroad programs are approved, and so many other tasks. I will also concurrently introduce the three staff members who work both strategically and on the minutia of making our program run. First, I'd like to introduce Tom Schultz, who's on this side of me. He is the DUS at the Marine Lab. And Katie Wood and Sarah Phillips, where are you all? There's Sarah. Oh, Katie's up top. Uh, let's have a hand for our Marine Lab faculty and staff. Here on campus, Emily Klein and Alex Glass are our directors of undergraduate studies for Earth and Ocean Sciences. Chantal is our, Reed is our director of undergraduate studies for environmental science and policy. And our intrepid on-campus staff person is Emily Blanchard, who's standing right over here. Seated to your left are some of the faculty who have taught your students in the major, advised them in regards to coursework, extracurriculars, and perhaps life, mentored them in a research lab, an independent study, or graduation with distinction program. They've taken them on field experiences around the country and around the world. Although this will take a minute to accomplish, their role has been transformative for many of your st our students. So I'd like to name each one and ask you to stand so that you can associate a face with a name you might have heard and perhaps easily identify them if you want to speak with them or get a picture later. So um, I'd like to introduce each, but if you'll hold your applause until I've introduced all of them. So from the Marine Lab in Beaufort, we have Doug Nowacek. Doug is the Randolph Repass and Sally Christine Rogers University Associate Professor of Conservation Technology. A quick tangent, stay standing. I'm going to make you all stand till I get all of you named. Did you notice all the names in Doug's title? We academics have a tradition to honor particularly distinguished faculty with named professorships or chairs that have been endowed by alumni or friends. So if you hear me say a professor's name followed by another name, that second name indicates the specific endowed chair that this professor has been honored to receive. So to get a, another example of this, Andy Reid, will you stand? Oh, Andy is still at the reception. He'll be here shortly. Andy is the Stephen Toth Professor of Marine Biology and Director of the Duke Marine Lab. Tom Schultz, who you've already met on earlier on this side, is an Assistant Professor of the Practice of Marine Science and Conservation, and he directs the Marine Conservation Molecular Facility. Located here in Durham, I welcome Gary Dwyer, a Senior Research Scientist. <laughs> Deb Gallagher, the, an Associate Professor of the Practice of Resource and Environmental Policy. Alex Glass, you've already met, he's a lecturer in Earth and Ocean Sciences. David Hinton, a Professor of Environmental Quality. Tim Johnson, an Associate Professor of the Practice in Energy and Environment. Emily Klein, Professor of Earth Sciences. Randy Kramer, the Julie Plant Granger Professor of Global Environmental Health. Susan Lozier, is Susan, oh yes, good, Susan. Ronnie Rochelle Garcia Johnson, Professor of Earth and Ocean Sciences. I don't know if Joel is down here yet. 
Oh, yay. They're hiding behind the flowers here. Joel Meyer, Associate Professor of Environmental Toxicology. Stuart Pym, the Doris Duke Professor of Conservation Ecology. Chantal Reed, who is an Assistant Professor of the Practice of Biology. Dan Richter, Professor of Soils and Forest Ecology. Marty Smith, George Woodwell, Professor of Environmental Economics. And Rebecca Vidra, Lecturer in ESP. Thanks to all of them. I'm getting very important news here that I miss Lori Benier, who is a professor of environmental economics here. Lori, would you stand as well? Yeah. Sorry, Lori. <laughs>